We found stuff. That's adorable. He knows how to point. Oh, that 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 made my day, chat. That made my day. Oh, hello. That's a lot of expensive alchemy ingredients. He got fish. There's been a murder. Gemless <clears throat> ring. Mm -hmm. Why is it shining? Apparently, this dead humanoid has opportunity attack. Suspicious. Like a collapsed entrance. Can't target it. Is there a um a check? A perception check? No. Subtle steps. Oh, hello. Is that blood? No. no. This flight is amazing. Best ability. Hoppers! Damn! You see, Scratch just m making that leap like the bestest boy. What's going on here? Oh, that gets us back uh, top side, which has a fast travel point that I'm interested in. This is the waypoint. Uh, we'll come back here later when we have our our group with us. Is so good. Footprints. that Suspiciously small footprints. Cave entrance and way top side. Uh, I guess we we'll check the cave since we're here. Anglaire on cellar. How do we know that from entering the cave? That's a trumpet. Oh, uh. Hi there, lady. The boss is expecting you. Hasn't forgotten what you did for him at Moonrise. The boss? Who? Uh, I don't know, I guess you're welcome. Um. Oh yeah, 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 the, the boss, absolutely. I um, I haven't forgotten what I did to the boss either. Bump nog, <laughs> what is his name? Is that Wolbrin? Puffy Fuffers. <laughs> it's too quiet up there. Hope the blacksmith hasn't sold us out. Or you. I saved your ass, lady. What are you talking about? I think I want my clan facing down one of those walking death machines with cutlery. 
Then leave me to my work. That sounds like a challenge. Do you have anything? Only if you're quick. Uh, I have, I have all my junk. How how did this change? What? Right. Um, not sure how that happened, but sure. Athletics plus one boot seize. What is martial excretion? Exertion. Uh, push past your physical limits, taking six d six piercing damage to gain an additional attack per turn and to double your movement speed. Wait, what? You take six to thirty-six damage. And then, what does that mean? Is that just for for the rest of the day or forever? It says per turn, not for the turn, per turn. Because Carla could well do that because she has the thing where she gets extra damage when she's low on H HP. Gnomes are granted plus two to dexterity halflings and dwarves gain plus one. That doesn't really help any one of us. Booming blows, your unarmed dex deal additional damage. Oh man, there is so much stuff for monks in this game. Find a target. If it's a steel watcher, it is stunned. Oh my god, that is expensive though. Can we get these gloves, chat? They look kinda interesting. And they're not super expensive. Yeah, let's get them. Let's um let's science this. Let's uh Where did they go? There. Okay. Now let me get back to it. Very well then. Good sir. Oh, I could go for a good meal. So this didn't work as we thought it would. It doesn't allow Carla to fight in the cloud, unfortunately. So I don't feel super bad about just unequipping that then. Where do these things glow? Go, glow. Right, more, more monk stuff. I think the devs were into the monk because there's so much unarmed attack stuff. I almost feel like it's a little bit biased towards monks, but. Anywho, where, where, where's the deckham gloves? There they are. Okay. All right, what now? At the ready. Pull the lever, Kronk. I'm sure that did something. Ah, Wolverine, how are you doing, good sir? Good to see you. Wasn't sure you'd make it to the city. Regretting it yet? I spent a lot of time thinking of worst case scenarios while I was locked in that cell you plucked me out of at Moonrise. I didn't imagine anything as bad as this. The Gondians have handed Enver Gortash the means to bring about the end of liberty in Baldur's Gate. And the citizens have rolled out the red carpet for the new tyrant. Resistance fighters are few and far between. My iron hands, what's left of the Harpers, and you. I hope. Yeah, 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 of course. Uh, this Gortex man, he's gonna, he's gonna get what's coming. I'm uh, 
I have reasons of my own for taking him down. As long as our objective is the same, the reason doesn't matter to me. We have a common enemy. But neither of us gets what we want until we deal with our biggest obstacle. And what is that, perchance? The Steel Watch. They're a threat to you, me, and every man, woman, and child in this city. Uh-huh. They act all civilized, servants of the people, but they only serve one man. When he becomes Grand Duke, it will only get worse. Laws will change, freedoms will vanish, and soon you'll be accused and sentenced before you've even committed a crime. And the fucking Gondians are to blame for all of it. You, uh, you are a little bit worked up. Perhaps the Gondians were infected with tadpole. Perhaps. All the more reason to get rid of them. I have a tadpole too, you know. They invented the Steel Watchers, and they're building an army of them. Building? They've always been happy to provide their technology to despots in exchange for a stipend and the freedom to work in peace. They would have licked Saravok's boots, given the chance. And now they'll kiss Gortash's ring while this city screams. I had a plan to put a stop to them. But the way things are now, if we stick our heads above ground, the watchers are on us like flies on shit. What's the plan? Same as it always is. Eliminate the threat. Easy. In this case, the foundry where these atrocities are produced. The Gondians are ingenious, but we're more than equal to them. There's nothing they can build that the Iron Hands can't tear down. I've built something unique for just that purpose. A rune powder bomb. First of its kind. Fifty wizards high on the weave couldn't summon this kind of firepower. Get the bomb inside the Gondian facility and boom. Problem solved. What, why do you want me to carry it? <laughs> Uh, it's going to be quite the explosion. I can't wait. Ha! I knew you were the practical sort. That's why we get along. The foundry is in the lower city, down by the docks. Beautiful building, belching smoke into the sky day and night. Getting inside won't be easy, but when you do, place the bomb at the heart of the facility. Get yourself back to street level. The streets will be clear of watchers in no time. Is, is no one gonna comment on this thing? The whole, you know, bloodshot eyes and everything. Got any scrollers here? Let's have a look. Over here. You don't mind me looking in your wardrobe, do you? Oh, that, that is definitely stealing. Okay. It's fine. Better not be cursed. What's up top? I can't control with you later. No chance. Mother kill I feel like we have progressed further than I would have liked. Can we try out a whiskey? Yeah, we are. Uh, I feel like... Oh, wait. Actually, we are... We are not that far away from where I thought... Uh, hold on. Where were... Uh? Okay, so this is where we came out of the thing. We never went left on, uh, on the coast. Which maybe is fine. Do we have the solution to the open hand uh, quest? Why do we want free Orphus? Control the elder brain. Mm. Mm. 
<laughs> Where is open hand? Oh, there we go. Find the lock to fit the flower key. Okay. Right, okay. And it said so on the key. I just don't remember what it actually said on the key. Uh, where was it? I think Astarion picked it up. Maybe. No? Emily? Did you pick it up? Oh, there we go. Prego's flop house. I guess uh, we go looking for Frego's flop house. Hello there, good smith. Welcome, adventurer. I take it you're new to Rivington. Yeah, no I just came out of your house. Choose from my fine selection of weapons. Yes, I seem to have it all. Clubs, swords, maces, bows, cutting and gutting galore. I don't oh, think we can find the perfect weapon for you. Uh, how will you know my perfect weapon? I provide a personalized service for my customers to make sure the weapon I choose is the perfect fit. Tell me. How do you like to kill? Oh, Ooh. I mean, I mean, th th this guy is talking my language already. Uh, <laughs> uh, slowly and painfully, quickly and efficiently. Depends on how who I'm killing and how much they piss me off. I like to make them bleed, sever arteries to your flesh, make them scream. Uh, I mean, unleash a flash, flood of magic on my enemies and watch them drown, I suppose. I see. Playing to your strengths. Keeping things simple. And when you kill someone, what do you feel? Chat, next time uh, we see his face, you, I would, I would like you to study it closely. Because that's what someone with murder boner looks like. Yell at one with the weave. It dances at my fingertips, longing to be used again and again. Killing holds no fear for you, does it? You understand what it takes and what it gives. Look at that one more murder question, boner question if you'll humor me. Do you think you could turn your weapon on those closest to you? Without hesitation. <laughs> Marvellous! <laughs> you treat your friends as a butcher leading cattle to the slaughter. the lady <laughs> so you're the lick spittle who crushed the bone lord's throne <laughs> have you come begging sniffing for our stones gortash won't like that a throat his black hand can't choke the spit from oh you could kill him, let him close, and make him feel the tickle of your blade between his ribs. <laughs> when you find the Lordling, tell him Orin is watching. So Orin is a shapeshifter. How long has she been watching? Try attacking me when we back in turn, you bloody coward. Oh, jeez. What in the nine hells are you talking about, bro? Now you're acting innocent, are you? After you near cave me bloody skull in, I'm gonna knock that smirk right off your face.
Uh, anything? Persuasion? Intimidation? Decepticon? I mean, we have we have all the bone eye. Let's uh, let's uh, talk our let's we talk our way out of here. You had a blow to your head, buddy. We are above. We can. We got this. The size of the mid. Well, I. I'm sure it were you. The moment, sir. Look at this face. I could uh, murder you. God's be damned. I don't know. I'd have sworn, but my head's pounding. I don't remember. I need a bloody drink. Go on, clear off. I've seen enough of your face today. But if I would have decided to clobber you, you wouldn't be here to accuse me. That's right. Uh, now... Where is this... thing we're looking for? Actually, what is going on with the whole circus? I feel like we didn't finish here. I mean, we didn't finish anything. I never did finish that. This lady. The city of stone and steel is an endless scream in nature's womb. I have felt no peace here until now. Your eyes stare. There is pain, endless and deep, but also devotion, blazing like the sun. You're in love. Are you not? I am now. <laughs> That's an interesting one. Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, sure, I do love someone. You are wise to admit it. When it comes to love, vulnerability is armor. Truth, a sword, and trust, a shield. I pray you wield all three, still. Bring the one you love to me. I will look into your hearts and see if your love is eternal or doomed eternal. Oh my god. Uh. Yikes. Uh. Do we need to get uh, do we need to get uh, Glade in here? I mean, Gale. Briads don't know the meaning of the word bra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not wrong. What do you say, Shadowheart? Love is it? I didn't realize I'd bowed you over that much. Give it a try then. Impress me. Did I just spend money? <laughs> don't tell Close Gale. your eyes, little ones. Be still as stone to earth, and remember to breathe. Our chat, breathe, breathe, and look away from the trees. I'm watching you. Oh my. I see you. I see the bond between you. So tender. So fragile. But do you see it for yourselves? Shadow heart. An endless storm surges behind sharp eyes. Listen. Think. From where does Shadowheart draw comfort on a cold, dark night? A bottle? Oh, oh. Ooh. Uh, a blanket. 
Chat, help. Help. It is either one or two. Judging others is pretty savage. <sighs> get me? That is not how you get happy fun times, okay? That is not how you get happy fun times. So, let's see now. When we had our cuddle sesh after we freed uh, the, the groove, she sat alone and uh, sniffed a good wine. That's somewhat... I'm sure it is, Carmen. I'm not shaming. I'm just saying it's... I don't think it's the right play. Good company and even better vintage. Or the night itself. Oh. Mm. I don't think no, I don't think either of these is wrong. Well put. Though I'll forgive a middling wine so long as the company makes up the difference. <laughs> We got it. Oh, Here this is a multi-part thing. Bond throngs with pleasure, strong, vital, pulsing with affection. The heart craves comfort, but needs respect. How does one earn the dark-haired maiden's respect? Uh, I mean, Zelio, uh, maybe this is out of uh, lacking tact, but. Could I interest you in a three-way? Ah, <laughs> uh, wow! I I am I'm all over the place today. Putting on a silly night. <laughs> <laughs> 